All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. And before we get into today's video, just want to let you know, we went ice camping and sadly and somehow I lost most of the footage. So I'm just going to be showing some clips from that. I mean, that it really sucks that I lost the footage because it was a pretty good ice video. So here's the clips of what I got. Mostly everything's set up in here. We're not putting in the third cot quite yet. We're just going to start fishing. I have the pan optics hooked up and uh, hopefully we can catch some fish here. So, the fish on the outskirts, so it looks like they might come in. Probably not. Nope, he's going away. All right. All right. Bryce's fish thing about a 12 and a half right there. Shit, here they come. Throw it back. Oh, yeah. Good job, Bryce. Oh, here we go. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh. No. All right, just got this about 13 inch or jigging. Gonna throw her back. You keep going at it. My bobber is starting to move down, so fish are starting to really turn on. You're fucking down with me. <laughs> All right, there's Bryce's crappie. We're gonna get a measurement on him real quick and then let him go. In the measurement? 13, like what? 13 and a quarter. 13 and a quarter? Oh, Hell yeah, Bryce. Let's go. Throw him back. Good job, buddy. Cool. <laughs> All right, so, so looking at the pan optics, saw this thing come by the bobber. Bar went down, pretty good fish. We're gonna let's see what we get for a measurement. 14 three quarters or what? Uh, biggest one for the night. Yeah, 14. <laughs> All right, one last look at that crappie right there. <laughs> Throw him back. It's a freaking tank fish. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, don't get it on camera, but Casey just got back-to-back -back crappies, uh, both about 10, 10 inches, so uh, we haven't really caught anything else. It's just been pretty slow. There we go, what's it, like 130? Yeah. Got a nice one off Bryce's line. Nice. All right, we're getting in the bed. Got a nice little crappie. And back. So, got a new SD card in. Took a little break after catching that one. Dropping back down with the drop jig and the plastic. Looks like a pretty decent pile of fish down there. There we go. A little bluegill. Dang it. Got this. A nine inch pumpkin seed. I'm measuring the ground back. There we go. Ooh. This one. This one. Right. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's a bass. Sweet. Nice. First best go for the release on this guy. Ooh. It's been a few years since I've caught a bass through the ice, so it's kind of nice. It's a solid gill right there. There we go. There we go. Oh, this is going to be a little perch. Crappy. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah, okay. What we got going on now? 
we're using a Lorenz live target to kind of scope out these fish. And then we're just taking the drill, drilling about where it says they are, and then uh, putting a graph down, seeing if there's fish there. I think we found some fish over here. I'm just gonna drop down, see if we can get them. There we go. There's a little whatever it is, yep. A little gill. Alright, let's see what this one is. Oh. Alright guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you liked it. Sorry it wasn't as long or as detailed. I was having some trouble with the camera stuff, so hoping this weekend get it all figured out. But be sure to like, subscribe, see you in another one.